Good morning. It's a totally different morning. Snow everywhere. It kind of sucks because we don't like bringing the girls out right now because it's super, super cold. But we are going to be going to FAO Schwartz today, which is like this huge toy store. I've never been there. In fact, I wonder if it's the store that's in Home Alone. Is that FAO Schwartz? I don't know. There actually used to be one in Seattle, but that closed down a long, long time ago. It'll be fun for Juliana to run around and me and Carol probably just like laugh at all the toys. <laughs> Hi guys! You're like pink cotton candy! <laughs> so cute. She burped? No, actually. Ohio gozaimasu! It's actually snowing outside, but it's beautiful here because we've got so many windows. Of course, Judy's favorite. Oh shoot, you need to get going. What time is it? It's almost time for you to go. One of my favorites at this hotel, okay. blueberry pancakes, and they are mighty delicious. Also, for the babies and for me, fruit platter. And you know, we always gotta do it with the Eggs Benedict. Oh, these look hella good. Local and GMO free. Oh yeah. Have a good breakfast. I love you guys. Mwah. Who bought you those sexy oh, yeah, those wedges, shoes. huh? Who bought you those? I asked the luego, yo. I'm on daddy duty today. Actually, I'm on daddy duty every, every day. But today, it's just us, ladies. Yeah, it's just us. Searching for those blueberries, look. Mia you know, went for it. Oh, and she got it. Yeah. Yeah, uh, you know what? There's more where that came from. Probably wasn't the smartest idea to wear these shoes. But I literally just bought these and Uggs. <laughs> so Uggs didn't quite match my outfit Hello. today. So we're trying to find our next meeting. And we don't know the name of the building. We just have an address. I hope your coffee is hot. <laughs> we're here at Kid Made Modern, owned by Todd Altman. And I just want to show you some of the really cool crafts that are available at Target right now. And they're talking about doing wholesale. But anyway, I'll show you what's really interesting. A giant crayon with 64 different colors. Okay, I think there's a thing right here. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Look how this is. Isn't that fun? I could totally see JB holding this and just going crazy with this crayon. Animal Adventure Block Kit. Juliana would go crazy. She, lo yeah, my daughter loves a ukulele. Oh, this is perfect. Yeah. You can decorate it with her initials. <laughs> so, Tony, did you also design some of this stuff? We helped with Todd with the design. Yeah. Thing. Yes. Yes. And we started with the book and then morphed into the consumer products. I love these giant crayons. Oh, yeah. this match. Isn't that great? This reminds me of a makeup palette. Yes. yes. I'm mesmerized by mm. Tony's office. <laughs> Look how cool this is. And then wait till you see the view. Bam. It's really beautiful. Can you tell what that is? It's a graveyard. You say it's two, over 200 years old? Here, let me come this, over here. Does that actually turn on, that light? It, I need to plug it in. Oh, I wow. we had to unplug it for cleaning. Actually, Todd made that. Wow. Uh, Christmas wow. presents one year. So how many? Can you put a clip on Juliana's hair? Yeah, it's just kind of in her face. <laughs> They're eating hella blueberries right now. <laughs> what the building looks like outside. Yeah. How does that? Oh. We're like literally in the middle of the street. I'm gonna be filming with Bloomberg News today. Really exciting. This is like my first TV interview where I'm actually at a studio. So this is a building. Scott said that this is owned by the former mayor of New York. Look how interesting that is. 
Okay guys, so we're inside the Bloomberg offices. I don't even know if you would call this an office. This is insane. It kind of reminds me of Google. Like, I think we're kind of in the cafeteria, but there's like snacks and there's soups there and like unlimited, like whatever you want, you can take. So I actually took <laughs> some fruit snacks for Juliana. You didn't take anything? No, not yet. There's this is insane. I'm gonna get my makeup done, or maybe I don't know, a touch up. Terry's gonna do some amazing work, but I love her makeup already. That's a real artist. Look, she has E Pearl, Mac, Inglot, everything. Look at Stacey it's so cool. Look, there's like a there's teleprompter and everything. Amanda Palmer. She did a crowdfunding. Yes, the best of all all star game. And then it was Valentine's that we came in. That was really cool. Super interesting and I mean awesome. I'm gonna be on TV and they said that they'll put the segment online, so I'll share that once I get it. We're back at the hotel. We were supposed to go to FAO Schwartz, but something happened. Poor Auntie Val. Okay, let's just talk about this. So, this one. So we're all at this lounge and we're just waiting for the girls because Stacey and I were set to go uh, play Mom! at the toy store. And then Benji calls. He's like, honey, you got to get out here. Bring a towel. And I'm like, oh my gosh. Was like, no, it was full on vomit. Projectile. Like an adult style. Oh my god. And I just feel for Kira because. You know what? This has happened before. Kira gets car sick, and so no. she vomited all of her oh, no. milk. And oh my god, I felt so bad for the driver because his whole car smelled like vomit. But anyway, I decided, you know what? We're just gonna go back to the hotel. We're just gonna settle here because it's, you know, it's just what's best for the kids and for us. So, I'm so glad for babies. <laughs> oh, you know, it got I all. Tried, I worked on my hair for so long. Oh and then I was like, the first thing I noticed was getting my hair out of the way. Oh, I know. And your outfit's so cute and it got in your boots, but thank you, Auntie Val. You've, yeah, you've been a trooper. Change everything. Yeah. <laughs> all is better. I'm in my house clothes. Kira took a nice bath and she's hi. clean. Hi. Mia just saying hi, guys, over there in the corner. Hi, guys. Anyway, so I was really excited because we were gonna go eat lunch at the Plaza Hotel. I heard there's like some eateries down on the bottom floor. Juliana, please be gentle. And we we're gonna go eat there and then play at FAO Schwartz. We probably don't have time to go anymore because like tomorrow I'm pretty sure we're gonna be or I'm gonna be filming with Neutrogena literally all day. So that's okay. I mean, even just hanging out here, because we're in the presidential suite, so there's lots of room for the girls to crawl and play, and I mean, at least they got to get some fresh air, even though it's freezing cold outside, at least they get to, like, be outside of the room. It's just not the best time for them to be outside. Yeah. But yeah, our... Hi, up. Yeah. Hi, up. Hi, up. Hi, up. So Benji is out. He's going to be having a late lunch with our media team. And then I think, oh yeah, Auntie Val and Stacey are going to go see a show. Yeah. You're going to Broadway. Broadway. Broadway, you're going to see Sienna Miller. <laughs> Sienna Miller. Isn't that crazy wow. that Sienna Miller is on Broadway? I'm seriously so happy to be with my girls right now. <laughs> What's wrong? Mom, mom, I'm stuck. Where, how are you stuck? You're just laying on the floor. Here, I'll give you a hand. <laughs> there you go. Are you better? Mom, help me. <laughs> Bet you walked four miles in the freezing cold. Hey, Julian, she's picking up from her nap. Come on. Oh, Rhino too? Look who's home. <laughs> you totally, did she see you? <laughs> Do you 
just want to use a restroom. <laughs> you stop, Daddy. <laughs> Do you need to go pee pee? No. Let's see. Pee pee sisters are sleeping still. <laughs> she loves dried fruit. I like healthy snacks. I love happy snacks. She loves it, not likes. Snowy. Yeah, we think we hear fireworks, but we don't see any. <laughs> and the, it must be on the other side of the hotel, but I think it is Chinese New Year. Wow! It's been snowing! It's snowing? Yes! Yeah. Come on, it's snowing! You want to see Mia? See, let's see. Oh, yeah. Dad. Hi, guys! Dad. Are you <laughs> telling the city hi, guys? Hi, guys! Hi, guys! Hi, cars. Hi, cars. Hi, cars. What else do you see? You see cars? Yes. What else? Eiffel Towers. Eiffel Towers. Oh, baby, Eiffel Towers in Paris. Hello. We're just hanging out tonight here at the. I keep wanting to call this apartment because it kind of feels like an apartment, but here at the hotel, we think we're just gonna rent a movie. Reggie said there's a red box nearby, yeah. and we're gonna order in. Maybe we could get the delivery guy to pick up the movie for us too. Oh, we have a dilemma here, okay? What? And nothing against hotels or this one specifically, but dang, when you're traveling with family, pack enough so you don't have to do laundry because for yeah. like six pieces, yeah. $70. Yeah, well, we we have to do laundry for the blankets because it smells like vomit, and we need to use those blankets for whenever the girls are going out, in, you know, in their car seats. So we're gonna have to get it washed, but it totally makes sense. Like, of course, hotels—they're not hotels aren't made for people to stay long. That's why they have like those Homewood suites or whatever yeah, they're called. Yeah, typically people don't buy it for so many yeah, I even noticed in Tokyo um, when we did like laundry, my, it was like my, insane expensive. Like my, um, it was so expensive that it was almost like a joke to even get your laundry done. They would charge even by underwear. Ridiculous. And I was thinking, hey, maybe we could, you know, go to a laundromat and get our laundry done there. But there's not even a lot around here. There's not a lot here? They said it's basically dry clean. Oh. What's what I miss about the Philippines? 10 bucks, they do your whole Oh thing. man, Philippines was awesome. You drop off your laundry, and then they they have it done within a few hours, and it's neatly folded. Benji's on this website. Same So I guess there's a bunch of restaurants on there, and they just deliver to your hotel. So that's convenient. Hey, Juliana, that's enough. Last one. No more. Yeah. She keeps eating these snacks before dinner. Yeah, that's you could have some after dinner. One more. No more. I said no. Put it back. Or do you want any towards a certain type of food? I just want something light because I feel like. Did you guys see that? Juliana's trying to be slick, trying to sneak in some more of her dried fruit snacks. Mm -mm, girlfriend, that was so. <laughs> I didn't even notice her doing it at the time. Chinese. No, not like. Hey, no more. We're gonna order food. Okay? Juliana, I already told you. Did you try to sneak? Mm hmm. Thank you. Wi-Fi. 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 
I'm picking out outfits for tomorrow's shoot. Really exciting. Like I said earlier, I have a shoot with Neutrogena. And I don't think it's going to be like a commercial that's going to be on TV. It's probably just going to be on YouTube and other platforms, I'm not sure. And the babies are going to be in it. It's not going to be a huge part, but just like a small part. And so they said just like solid colors, nothing too heavy in print. The thing is we were planning to stay at the Airbnb apartment. And in that apartment there was laundry. So we didn't bring a whole bunch of laundry for a week and a half. But luckily, I still had kids clothes that were pretty much solid colors. So this is Juliana's outfit tomorrow. This is gonna be Mia or Kira. And then I have another top here. That's ready to go. And I'm just getting their clothes prepared early because by the time the girls leave, I'll already be at the shoot because I have to be there early in the morning. Okay guys, I'm not sure what to wear tomorrow. I think I'm gonna wear this. Oh. What'd she say? Um, oh! Yeah. <laughs> what is that? Somebody surprised us. Aww. Honey, we are too spoiled. I know, this is, that's, they're so generous. Merlot, can you? Oh my goodness. Thank you, Yamil. Or I should say, gracias. Alright guys, no, time so for, do you know what time it is? No. It's time for comment of the day. Bye. Are you going to do comment of the day too? Um, yes. Surprise. You're doing egg surprise? Yeah. Okay, well I'm going to do comment of the day. Do comment of the day. Comment of the day is from Lizeth Salmeron. And she writes, Auntie Val is so sweet. She has a natural maternal instincts and she really is the sweetest she does amazing with kids and she used to be a kindergarten teacher so she's very patient and loving and nurturing and we're so lucky to have her with us um thank you and for those of you wondering auntie val does have a craft channel it's called crafts with val so check it out if you type it in you'll see her videos she has just a few in there she's doing educational crafts if you guys are interested check it out we're wrapping up our day we will see you guys tomorrow bye bye juliana bye